Yes, so welcome back my students. So let's consider our fourth biology topic. And this is the introduction class of cell physiology. And so by the end of this topic, you the learner should be able to define cell physiology. So let's do that and look at other objectives. So this is a study of the functions of the different parts of the cell. The definition is that simple. Cell physiology is the study of the functions of the different parts of the cell. So you can't take this topic if you not checked out the previous topic where we look at the cell as a topic by itself. So having defined what cell physiology is, uh, our next objective would be to correlate the membrane structure with cell physiology in rela relation to permeability differentiate between diffusion, osmosis, and active transport, state and describe factors affecting diffusion, osmosis, and active transport, carry out experiments on diffusion and osmosis, explain the roles of diffusion, osmosis, and active transport in living organisms, and finally, we're going to try and explain saga and plasmolysis in terms of osmotic pressure. So the other practical activities which are quite fun. So make sure you subscribe so that we see you in our next class when we have all this fun. See you in our next class.